the Higgins Kapiti Quarry is gearing up for the Mackay to Pekka Pekka Expressway. It's now set to supply over a million tonnes of aggregate. MP for Ōtaki Nathan Guy came to visit to see the massive increase in production. Today out here at the quarry, uh, seeing what's happening here, uh, 15 times the growth of what it used to be. So we're seeing 160 trucks come out of this site a day. 15 fold increase in production going out the gate has meant you know, major investment in machinery. An example, we've got two 45, 50 tonne excavators, two Volvo dump trucks, a D8 dozer, it's probably a $2 million investment in plant. Staffing numbers gone from two to seven, and of course all of those truck drivers as well. Obviously the investment too is going forward for other major projects, not just this project, so um, there's obviously investment looking forward. Extracting ununiform aggregate in one of New Zealand's steepest quarries has its challenges. The type of material is quite ununiform, so we have to chase the good material. Um, yeah, it's very steep, so we have to um, work our way up with these benches. We have to obviously remove the overburden off the top as we've progressed, so we've got quite a small footprint to work in. So it's just the logistics of working out the haul routes in, the haul routes out. If you note that the dump trucks have try to work on independent haul, haul tracks so we're not interfacing the truck and trailers with the dump trucks. And the production too, you know, weather dependent, this material is, um, is quite weather sensitive so when it rains it's got a fair bit of clay in the material so the existing material we're cutting out to the project when it's raining we have to stop. Um, but when the sun's out, as you see, it's all go. There's also some smart thinking going on with the paving design. We're actually designing the pavement specifically for this material, so we're actually looking at modifying it with lime to mitigate some of the clay properties within the material. We have driven the pavement design for this project based on the actual local resource available instead of looking at you know, the other way around. The positive thing about this is the location of this quarry right next to all the expressway so instead of burning a whole lot of diesel hauling the product up from Wellington or further north uh, we've got the aggregate right on site. Uh, we've done some numbers if we had to transport all this material from Wellington we'd probably be looking at um, an excess of an extra two million litres of diesel just to transport it and then the impact on the, the roading network so it's certainly a good opportunity to use a local resource to minimise the impact on the roading network you know best for project best for region so it's been a win-win for everyone. <laughs>